Welcome to the introduction to the 5S program, the method of organizing and standardizing the workshop. The 5S method is an internationally proven method, at first used particularly in large multinational companies. More and more companies have discovered its strength. This training has been realized thanks to the helpful cooperation of Philips Electronics, Smith Transformers, NACO Materials Handling Group, Timiraya, Minkles. All these companies have introduced 5S and both the scenes and the interviews used in this training originate from them. Especially on behalf of this training, a number of unsafe or undesirable situations have been staged. These views are not representative of the high awareness of quality and the level of working conditions in these companies. We thank the management and staff of these companies for their open-mindedness and enthusiasm in cooperating with this training package. The best companies in the world already use methods like lean manufacturing, total productive maintenance, Six Sigma, world-class manufacturing and total quality management to realize the high demands put to their products. Whichever program is used, 5S is generally considered the right basis for world-class production. In this introduction, we get to know the 5S method and its advantages. Let us first listen to the experiences of people using 5S. First we hear some managers, then some operators. 5S heeft 5S has changed things. The first thing that strikes you is how the factory looks. And secondly, the operators have become much more involved in organizing their own working areas. The situation before was there were things with no name or place and they just pinned up new rules all the time anywhere. And everyone wasted time searching. Where has that thing gone? Then the change came, then we got order and cleanliness, so every piece of equipment, with its accessories, was given its own place. There is one place to put up notices and so on, and where to move junk or rubbish to, that kind of thing. The greatest advantage has been that people have taken on this task themselves, and their way of thinking has changed as well. Now they put much more thought into organizing their workplaces themselves, and keeping them organized. Since the introduction of 5S, the machines are left behind in better condition for the next operator who takes over. In the past, we'd get comments from customers like, what's that stuff over there? What's all that for? There were customers who said, those things were in that same corner when I was here two months ago. If you're not using them, get rid of them. And customers like their products to be worked on in orderly surroundings. It's a cultural turnaround. And you see steady improvement. Greater responsibility and greater involvement go together. You notice operators becoming more enterprising, understanding, and seeing better how what they're doing fits in with the aims of the company. Before, when we were due for an inspection, we evacuated the whole factory. We scrubbed, polished, well, everything, just for the sake of these inspectors. These days, there's simply no need. The inspectors just arrive, and in general, they're very satisfied. You come to realize that the customer wants more than just low price and good quality. He wants his product made in a well-ordered factory where it's just clean. 5S originated in the Japanese automotive industry. Meanwhile, all over the world, 5S is considered the right basis of professional production. The purpose of 5S is to achieve an efficient, well-organized workshop with teamwork as its main condition. Step by step, 5S leads to this in five stages, all beginning with an S. Before actually starting the 5S method, we first look at the existing situation. This is called scanning or analyzing the work area. Here we analyze the work area which from now on we call the target area and we take stock of the bottlenecks. 
This forms the basis for 5S activities. These 5S activities are sorting, considering what is really necessary, setting in order, again giving a place to what is necessary, shining, cleaning and inspecting what has got its place, standardizing, laying down how to keep taking the first three steps, sustaining, checking and maintaining the program. We will elucidate further on these five S's. Experience shows that the 5S method is good for the general working atmosphere and thus contributes to realizing the company's objectives and to safety. After the analysis, we start sorting. We're going to recognize and to make wrongly stored and superfluous objects visible. We will have to establish what is the right place for these objects. You'll find that many things that have been left are never used again, in fact, so they're in the way. After showing what is unnecessary, we're going to take the next step, setting in order. We will arrange what should be where. Just consider how often you have to walk some way to fetch something. Could this be done more practically? We should also be able to see at once if something is lacking. A place for everything and everything in its place. The next S in the program is shining. This serves two purposes. First, working in a clean and well-ordered area is more pleasant, but it also helps to spot faults, wear or defects in the production line or of tools at an early stage. After executing the first three steps of 5S, we've already achieved a great deal. Your workshop will look tidier and cleaner and you can work there more easily. If the new situation is satisfactory, you'll have to make decisions and deals to keep it this way. These matters, hints and methods will be dealt with more extensively in this step of standardization. Now that arrangements have been made through standardization, the circle is almost fully rounded. The more 5S is carried out by everybody, the better the result. 5S is real teamwork. In the last S, we deal with what everybody, both the staff in the workshop and the executives, can do to maintain this. This step is therefore called sustaining. To reach world-class production, you must want to measure up to the best. 5S is the basis for this. It yields many advantages for everybody in the workshop. Also, customers, insurance companies and the inspectors of working conditions always react positively to improvements realized by 5S. For in the long run, a quality product can only be made in a well-organized orderly workplace. Introducing 5S is not achieved as a matter of course. You can only be successful by good mutual cooperation within the team and between team and executives. You will soon notice that 5S is advantageous for everybody and makes it easier to reach the company's targets. We wish you good luck and success in applying 5S.